Hi guys, this is Angel from PRDV Entertainment. Today I want to show you guys how to work uh, with your Blender using uh, a character that you want to move around your map. Now for that, let's delete this cube here. Let's insert a plane. So I'm going to the other mode and I'm going to scale this, make it bigger. Now I'm getting out. I'm going to insert a new cube here. So I'm going to pull it up. I'm going to my cube properties here. I'm going to change this to wire on the display so we can see the inside of the box and now I'm gonna scale it up a little bit I'm gonna pull it up and from here I'm going to add a camera for adding a camera shift A so I'll go down camera I'll pull it up oh my bad so I need to go to our quad view so we can make this really good so from here I'm gonna choose to add a camera here now we need to rotate this on the right Ortho, ortho, as you can see here, we need to rotate it at 90 degrees. So press your R, X, axis, and type 90. Press enter, pull it up. And now, as you can see, it's going backwards uh, from the Y axis, so it has to go to the other side. So we need to rotate this to the Z, 180 degrees, and we have it right there on, on the front. So now we need to pull this out from the box so we don't see the, the inside of the mesh. We're going back to our perspective view. And now I'm going to choose the box here. So I'm going to, uh, on the box, on the you need to go to your uh, right panel here on your physics properties. Oh, my bad. To change this blender game. There we go. Now on the physics, you need to tell the, ga the engine is going to be a character. There we go. So now let's add the movement for this body here. This cube is going to be your body. So we will add the W, the S, the A, and the D key from your keyboard and the space bar. So you can move around in the space bar so you can jump. So for that we need to open a new window here. Da -da -da -da. And we need to go to the logic editor. Now for this, we have you have to have the box selected. Now let's insert five sensors. So it's going to be uh, keyboard, the five of them, four, five. So now I'm going to put names up, down, left, right, jump. So I'm going to tab, I'm going to click on all of these and now I'm going to put here W S A D spacebar so now I'm going to minimize this here and now we need to add the actuators we need to add five of them it's going to be motion 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 and motion so from here I'm going to put here forward, forward, backward, left, move, right, uh, there we go, right, move, right, move, right, move, and jump, put, jump action, there we go. So now we need to link this to e uh, each one on the sides. So I'm going to start with this one here. I don't remember which one is, so I'm going uh, to find out here. Okay, so the X is the red one. So that, that one goes to the sides. Okay, so we need to free 10 minus, I think is for going uh, up. No, for, I think it's for going to the sides. Let's test it out. Let's see what happens. Okay. So I need to get out of here. This is not the one. This right here. There we go. So now we have it looking uh, running forward. So now I'm going to pull this down, I'm going to pull this to the side, minus 10, 
So now I'm going to change this one. It's going to be right, left. Now we got to parent this here. And for the space bar, you need to choose on uh, character motion. You need to click on jump or else it will not jump at all. Now let's test it out. Let's test it. There we go. Okay, my bad. I think I left one here backwards, forward. Yeah, left it the same. There we go. There we go. And Jesus Christ, what the heck? It's right here. My bad. There we go. So now if we go to our perspective view here, and we have another camera that we have to delete it. So I'm going to delete this camera, going to the other one, and now I'm going to run the game. I can't see nothing. That's bad. I don't know why. Okay. So I'm going to pull this back a little bit. Oh, we need to parent this. I forgot about that. You pre uh, click first on the camera or you will be able to do anything at all. Click on the camera, then shift, right click on the box and you need to parent this pressing your control and the P on your keyboard. And now press enter and now we have parent this along. So every time your body moves, your camera will also move. Okay, now let's test it on a camera here. There we go. Now let's jump. There we go. And now we need to add uh, our mouse movement. So for that, we need to choose the camera here. And we need to go to our text editor, create a new one. So I'm going to put here mouse look. There we go. Now I'm going to find my scripts. For this, you need to insert the scripts. And I know a lot of people don't like uh, working with scripts, but there are a lot of scripts already made on the internet, so you can download it. And I'm going to uh, I'm going to put this one on the description, the download link, so you can download the script and use it for your project. So there we go, run script, okay, I know you have an error, always like that, huh? And now we need to choose a uh, mouse on our all logic editor. Let's put movement. And from here we need to add a Python controller. So we are going to parent this with the mouse movement and we are going to choose our script. Now let's test it. There we go. So now we can see around the map. Now if you go into your camera here, as you can see, we can see now around. So that should be all for the character movement tutorial. I'll be showing you guys how to insert guns and how to make a first person shooter game uh, pretty soon. Hope to see you guys on our next tutorial. This is Angel, guys. See you next time.